all of my professors took great pride in assuring the students that nothing that they uh, were talking about had any possible applications. But Solomon Galam knew differently. His mathematical sequences not only helped us have fun, but revolutionized communications. The subjects I was specially interested in turned out to be ideally suited to the emerging world of digital computing and digital communications. Galam's concept of shift register sequences would enhance America's emerging space program. I was part of the early orbit determination team for Explorer 1. We uh, developed many of the basic approaches to uh, how to do space communications. His work at the Jet Propulsion Laboratory would ultimately enable deep space communication and lead him to compile the first book on digital communications. One of my co-authors on that book, Andrew Viterbi, he attributes uh, what he learned and was doing in my group at JPL for his idea of using shift register sequences in cell phone communication. And the reason why millions of cell phone users can make simultaneous calls without overlapping. For more than 30 years, Galam has taught at the Viterbi School of Engineering at USC. Being at a university also gave me a lot more time to think through the ideas that were already percolating in my mind. A prolific writer with a passion for games and puzzles, Golom's popular polyominoes inspired the hallmark game Tetris. One of the things that has always been useful is my ability to see connectedness 